Hello, everyone. I am Zhao Chuan. Today, let's color the Giganotosaurus. Giganotosaurus was a very large animal, so its body color would not be particularly bright. Most of its body would take on a gray shoe, like that of an elephant. But the color of its abdomen was lighter. We can take reference to the color of a crocodile's abdomen to color it. In addition, although its overall color was relatively dark, some parts of its face would be in bright colors. First, let's color the soft parts of its body with beige. These parts include the lower jaw, throat, chest, abdomen, the rear of thighs, and the underside of the tail. We fill the area around its eyes, and the part from the antipodal fenestra to the temporal fenestra with beige too. Next, let's color most parts of its body with light gray, including its mouth, neck, back, body sides, limbs, and tail. Then, let's color the keratinous structures on its head with yellow. On the face, we can color some transitional areas with yellow. Between the dark and light colors on its body, we can also use yellow to make the color transition naturally. After that, let's color the upper part of its antipodal fenestra with tangerine to make this part look brighter.
Finally, let's draw some patterns on its body with dark grey. Fill its mouth with pink. On the parts of its body that are often bent, we can use pink too, which will make its body look softer. Color its toenails and eyes with brown. In this way, we've finished coloring the Giganotosaurus.